Did you know that Dexter Jetster may have had a hand in taking down the Imperial Palace on Coruscant after the Battle of Endor? His story in Return of the Jedi from a certain point of view, The Veteran by Adam Lance Garcia, catches up with the prequel character in the immediate aftermath of the destruction of the second Death Star. He grapples with guilt over, at least in his mind, helping the Galactic Empire come to power in the first place, pointing Obi-Wan Kenobi on his path to discovering Kamino and the clone army. I say that's not on you, Dexter, but I understand why you would feel some responsibility. He witnesses the statue of Emperor Palpatine being pulled down in Monument Plaza, he sees citizens carrying a stormtrooper planning to throw him over the side, but he also sees a young girl stop the mob, saving the trooper's life. When more troopers arrive and start firing on the civilians, Dexter and the young girl wind up hiding in his old diner, which had been closed for years at this point. But he sees an opportunity to make amends for the guilt he feels, and teaches the girl named Vecan about smuggling tunnels that are hidden throughout Coruscant's underbelly. He says the tunnels lead to places the Imperial would never know to look for, and they could make a difference in the days ahead. It's not confirmed, but I think that could all tie into the Aftermath trilogy by Chuck Wendig, which partially tells the story of Coruscant's eventual fall and surrender, which involves a group of young rebels who use tunnels to reach the Imperial Palace, where they rescue Masamita, the legal head of the Empire who was being held against his will. His escape meant he could reach out to the New Republic and offer his official surrender after the Battle of Jakku. So it's very possible Dexter Jetster had a direct influence on the end of the Galactic Civil War. He may not have ever known it, he may not have done so on purpose, but he didn't help the Clone Wars start on purpose either. It's kind of a fitting mirror to his introduction in Attack of the Clones. But that's it for today. If you haven't already, please like this video, subscribe to the channel, follow us on our socials, and consider checking out our Patreon page. As always, thanks for watching, and may the Force be with you.